morning guys and welcome to our UK staycation vlog. Today we are down in East Mersey. Chris's parents and family have got a static caravan on the Park Dean Resort in East Mersey and they've had it for about a year now but we've never actually come down to stay here and then we decided to come down for a few days during the May half term so I thought I would vlog our day today. We've actually been here for a day and a half already but because um, when we first came down like all Chris's family came so we were just catching up and everything I was going to do like a kind of a whole time here blah, 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 blah. vlog but I just haven't been vlogging so far so I thought I would just vlog today we are just walking up the road now to this little bar and a really nice cafe so we're just going up there now to have a little coffee and a cake and then later I'm really excited about this actually because they've got like a um, vineyard not like five minute drive from here isn't it and um, they make their own wine which apparently is delicious so I'm really excited to go over and have a little look because you guys know how much I love my wine so I want to go no Chris has got a poo bag oh that's disgusting that's not even a funny joke <laughs> it's blinking beautiful day guys blinking beautiful How was your brekkie? Good. The oh. pancakes were so nice. Weren't they? Ros, do you like your pancakes? Yeah, it's very nice. Show them what we just bought. So when I was younger, if you guys are kind of my age who are watching this or older, I think uh, you might remember, but I used to collect marbles. And when I was at school, you used to have like, make like marble runs and you'd have to flick your marble along, like roll it along the ground. And then if you hit someone else's marble, you got to keep their marble. So people would come in with like super rare marbles, like misties and shinies and all sorts of things like that. And we used to just play marbles to um, get your collection even bigger. So we found these marbles, they were £2.40 and the boys now said they want to play a game from the olden days. Apparently I'm from the olden days <laughs> because I was born in 1984. So we're going to go home and I'm going to teach them how to play marbles. You can't wait, can you? Mm -hmm. That breakfast was so good. I had like kippers and um, kippers on toast and it was a whole kipper no, that they'd just kind of opened say, up and then I grilled. I say it was on toast. No, on it was the on the side of toast, but with side. toast, kippers with toast. Do you like this olden day game? I don't know, that's not fair. You can't keep running away, that's not fair. I'm not running away. No, that's... I'm just so, it doesn't go on there. Oh, good one, Jay. Yeah, that was a great shot. Right, so before we come in and mess the place up, I thought I'd just give you a little tour of where we're staying for the next few days. So this is their caravan, and you've actually got a sea view down there. I mean, the day's not very nice. So you can't see the sea very well. And then the decking goes all the way around here, like that. Um, and then you come back inside. Kitchen area in here, which is so nice. You've got like a hob and a ovens. You've got a dishwasher. This is a slimline dishwasher and it comes with a microwave. The caravan comes with like loads and loads of mod cons and then they just added some extra bits. And then you've got your fridge freezer, you've got a little dining table here, which is sweet. And then as you go through, you have got, so it's got two double bedrooms, but I'll show you what they've done with one of them. This is the um, bathroom. You've got a little shower in here, which is nice. That's actually a really, really good shower. Um, then this is where the boys are going to be sleeping in here so this is the boys bedroom which is a double the beds are also really comfortable then we have this bedroom in here this is um where all the babies sleep so this is actually a double this is one of the beds and there's another bed here which will go down here but because they've got babies they have this set up as like a cot room and then they just store all kind of baby things in here so they can just take them out whenever they need them so they've got the high chair and everything like that and then this is the main bedroom in here so you've got a double bed really really comfortable You've got a little vanity unit bit here. And then this bedroom has a little ensuite. Right, so this is down by the kind of like clubhouse bit. This is a little uh, basketball and football 
area and then we've got a little tennis court with there and then we've got in here this is an indoor swimming pool and then they've also got an outdoor swimming pool behind there and then that is the clubhouse so i think this is one of the smaller park dean resorts there's the indoor pool the boys came down earlier to the arcade so we're just coming in here to get them lulu's not allowed in but we're just going to come and get them they're old enough now to just kind of come down by themselves we give them like five pounds they just come in here and play along the beach apparently if we walk along here for a little bit more we come to like this big like wooden climbing frame thing so we're gonna go and check that out this is like your childhood right uh yeah quite a bit of it this was like his childhood he would come down here all the time because his nan and granddad had a um had a caravan on in west mersey so this is just like how he remembers growing up he's coming down to Mersey all the time going crabbing. We're going to take them tomorrow morning, so maybe I'll include that into this video. Just like a little snippet of it while I talk to you here. And um, he loved it. He said it was such a great childhood. There were no devices, there was no TV. There was just tree climbing, crabbing, and just playing outside really. So yeah, we're just trying to recreate that for our kids. Gosh, JJ. There's just loads of these little like bits of um thank you baby. Thank you, my darling. This is fun, it's an adventure. Oh look, we're back on the beach now. Good girl, Lulu. Getting all the swamp water off you. Just got back from our walk. Lulu's had a wash and now I've just made a platter of crudités and dips. So I've got some carrots cucumber and peppers the boys are just at the arcades and here my friends is my balanced life i've got a lovely glass of red wine loads of veggies and dips and a beautiful husband oh yeah balanced life and a beautiful husband handsomely beautiful aren't you <laughs> rory your socks look awful take those off quick before you put them anywhere were they white to begin with or were they always just brown i can actually see your toenail print in them they That's disgusting. asked if he could run alongside the car as we drive to the caravan. Oh, there he is. What's that? A fortnight dance. Is that the loser fortnight dance? Ah, you cheated. Cheater, 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 cheater. You're a cheater. How am I a cheater? You went the wrong way. We cheater, couldn't follow cheater, you. Cheater. So we just got back from the vineyard and I thought I'd show you what we got. So we got these little like Mersey Island um, beers, different 
flavors i guess and then we also got the blush this is quite expensive it was 15 pounds 50 a bottle um so that is quite a lot more than what i would normally spend in a bottle but i thought we're supporting local businesses and it's meant to be very, very nice. So just making us all some dinner. I'm doing like a sausage casserole type thing. So in here I've got some loads of different beans. I've got cannellini beans. I've got my mixed beans ones I always get in the spicy tomato sauce. And then I've got chopped tomatoes, a veggie stock cube. I've got some chipolates. But then in the oven down here I've also, oh, it's gonna steam up. Got some big fat sausages as well. And then I just went and got these bake at home little rolls. So I'll pop those in the oven in about 10 minutes time once this is all nicely cooked, but it's smelling absolutely delicious. Lulu Pie is absolutely exhausted. She's literally, I think, falling in the water and having a shower has totally exhausted her. She's now ready to just sleep for the rest of the night. Rory's here, he's gonna be asleep in about three and a half minutes, but we haven't even had dinner yet. Chris is still, we found a movie. What are we watching again? Tomb Raider. Tomb Raider. So we've got Netflix on Chris's phone. We've linked it up to the telly. It's actually quite cool. That's what I mean, this house is, or this, this caravan is so organized. They've got everything here that you would ever need. Look how delicious this is looking. Oh my goodness, guys, this is such a beautiful evening. After such weird weather all day, we have now got this beautiful sunset. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it and I will see you guys again next time. Bye!